Eunice Kennedy Shriver has died at the age of 88. Family members had gathered at the hospital in Massachusetts last night. Eunice Kennedy had been in critical condition since last week. Her family issued a statement this morning saying she was the light of their lives and led a life of love and service to others. CBS News Chief Washington Correspondent Bob Schieffer looks back. She was born into one of America's most prominent families, the fifth of nine Kennedy children. Graduating from Stanford University in 1943, she later became a social worker at a West Virginia prison. She married Sergeant Shriver in 1953, and together they had five children, including Maria Shriver, now the wife of California Governor Arnold Schwarzenegger. It was growing up with a close family member who was mentally retarded, her sister Rosemary, that led to Eunice Kennedy Shriver's life's work, the establishment of Special Olympics. Her goal, she said, was to demonstrate that people with mental retardation are capable of remarkable achievements in sports, education, employment, and beyond. It began in 1962 as a summer camp at her home in Maryland and led to the first Special Olympics Summer Games held at Chicago's Soldier Field in 1968. 1,000 athletes from 26 states in Canada competed. Today, the Games have more than 1.3 million participants in over 150 countries. In 1984, Ronald Reagan awarded Shriver the highest civilian honor, the Medal of Freedom. Her decency and goodness have touched the lives of many and Eunice Kennedy Shriver deserves America's praise, gratitude, and love. Born to privilege, she made her life's work helping those who had little. She wrote Special Olympians and their families are proof that the value of human life should be measured in many ways. Eunice Kennedy Shriver was 88.